working in a microbiological laboratory, certain rules have to be uh, considered because working with bacteria and different pathogens, you always have to watch out not to infect yourself, the environment, or your cultures. So certain rules apply at all the time. By recognizing and understanding these guidelines that rule in the microbiology lab, we can safely and effectively work with microbes without contaminating ourselves, the environment and the cultures. Please make sure and keep in mind that the microbes we work with are potential pathogens. If you have any underlying medical conditions, please let your TA know and make sure nobody gets contaminated or infected in the microbiology laboratory. This section provides an in-depth view of the guides and regulation in a microbiology lab. Each student needs to know and follow basic lab rules to reduce any potential risk, avoid exposure to pathogens, allow handling expensive equipment, and preventing hazardous conditions. This portion of the lab conduct and safety can be addressed before beginning an experiment or even entering your workspace. Please dress appropriately in consideration of the lab activities for that day. It is mandatory to wear the lab coat provided to you and is recommended to wear long pants. Footwear must be closed-toed and cover a majority of your foot. Gloves are required when working with RNA, DNA, clinical and fecal samples, etc. For daily routine work, we do not recommend wearing gloves when using an open flame. Remember, there is never any eating or drinking in the lab. Upon entering and exiting the lab, wash hands thoroughly with the proper soap. Note the locations of the first aid kits, emergency showers, and fire extinguishers for emergency purposes. When working on your designated lab table, Make sure your space is cleaned and organized. Clear the area of any non-essential materials. Also note that the lab bench has to be cleaned before and after with a disinfectant. Writing materials, printed instruction, as well as laptops and cell phones are encouraged for assistance in note-taking, picture-taking, and further research. Keep such personal items away from the cultures to prevent contamination, and no using such equipment for unrelated lab topics will result in a loss of participation points. If any accidents such as spills, cuts, or burns occur, immediately report them to your instructor or lab TA. Review these initial lab conduct and safety rules, being aware that disregard for such guidelines may result in dismissal from the course. Once comfortable with this part, move on to part two, concerning daily routines.